is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Well, when you see it like that, their central midfield players look a little bit isolated. But I'm expecting the two fullbacks to push up to make it more of a 3 4 3. And I think we see a lot of positional rotation in this starting 11. a go. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Now sending it in. And using his body to good effect. Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. Short corner it is. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. Well, opting for the short corner. Takes the shot. And the keeper more than equal to it. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? in the centre can't miss surely vital intervention thwarted by the post and a goal the opener in the semi-final first goal of the contest well as the replay shows us it's a decent first effort but he's so quick to get onto the rebound that's a good finish Kane. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. Oh, a smart stop. Well, just listen to these Spurs fans. They're driving their team forward here. Kane! A glorious opportunity it was. And the referee blows his whistle. That is the end of the contest. And a fine result for the away fans. And if they can repeat this sort of performance on home soil, then they will surely be going through. Well, they'll be pleased with that victory, but it's a slender lead they're taking into the second leg. And I think they'll be confident, but it's going to be tight, that's for sure. Well, Stuart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today. 